Hi there. So today is my birthday and I'm quite excited and giggly. I don't know why. And yeah, Jörg and I thought we would be filming a little bit throughout the day and just share what we're up to. It's just the two of us, as you know. And I just had a huge surprise. I got this gorgeous flower bouquet from Jörg. And then I got another surprise delivery and I had no idea who sent this. And I just opened the card and it's from Jörg's mom. So from my mom and law. It's so nice. This is beautiful. So I have two huge flower bouquets and they make me happy. Yeah. And first, yes. you were telling me, Jörg, did you order a second bouquet? Yeah, I had no idea what was or going on. Did something go wrong? Or yeah. More? Yeah, because it's the same. It's the same service. Yeah, that's so strange. But this one is beautiful as well. So yeah. when I when I opened the door, there were these two big bouquets, and I was like, I thought the lady probably thought, why isn't she happy? But I was just confused for a second. So I put these ones in vase as well. But uh, you know what? We usually don't really. We don't really have big vases no. because I I don't really have a lot of bouquets throughout the year because I don't know I prefer garden flowers. This of course is beautiful, so lovely. Oh, they smell so nice. Mama, das hast gut gemacht. <laughs> yeah, danke schön, hallo Laura, und danke schön, ja. Lovely, so back in a second. I will put that one on the table. What do you think? Yeah. It's gorgeous. Yes. It's lovely. And you know what? What I can do now is I will lay the table, then I have another. Big surprise coming. So, the first thing I'm going to do is lay our coffee table. It's probably a very German thing to do. To finish it off, we have table cards. Kirsten and Jörg. So you need to see them close up. So we have some place cards made with pheasants and we've got our name with hashtag fab 50 kirsten <laughs> but not only that thinking of what might be coming later in summer we have them for all our family and they are different pictures and so they are different different kind of pheasants and we will taking them to Germany later in the year. So one of my sisters was so kind and she sent a big parcel together with my parents with two balloons and <laughs> it is so so kind and funny so of course we're going to use them today. So this is a bottle of champagne and we have the champagne glass as well. <laughs> so the first balloon for vintage good times, very fitting. And this is the 
champagne glass. Oh. Cheers. That would be the right size for you. I have to Balloons are up. Why oh, you're so dark, Jörg? <laughs> That's lovely. The next highlight is waiting, which has to do with... It starts with a C. Oh. What was that? Really? <laughs> yes. Here's the surprise. <laughs> A lovely pastel coloured cake, which was on my wish list. <laughs> and it's gluten free. And yeah, I will tell you how that came about later. It's quite big, isn't it? And a little bit of Wanting. Beautiful. <laughs> I really love it. This is so nice. Makes it so special. You know what I can use? So this morning I opened the card from my oldest sister and opened it and it had 50s <laughs> in the card. And I can use them. We can use them for the table. And just place them around the cake. Now let's have some cake. It's quite big. This would be, it would be enough for our entire family. And I think because there will be lots of leftovers, we will freeze some, some slices, I'm sure. And then we can just half that and share it. Oh, that looks nice. See? That looks lovely. Mmm. So we just want to film it like that, that you can get our initial reaction. Thank you. Give it a go. Good. Mm. Oh, it's good. Oh, this is lovely. This rem this reminds me of um in Germany. Like I had the last gluten free cake made when I turned forty. That was years before we moved to the UK, and it's similar. It's really good. So we had this cake made from the Devonshire, Devonshire Bakery in Frodsham and they have a cake studio, I'm not sure how to pronounce it, Crothers, Crothers Cake Studio, something like that. And I came across, I did a lot of research actually, you know, remember Jörg, like I discovered the most beautiful cakes in London and they are called 
April's Bakery. And I can leave that for you, you will fall in love with the cakes. And then I got in touch with several bakeries here. None of them said they could make it because it's, I, I don't know, a kind of frilling technique that not everybody can do. And they were so kind and they said, send us a picture and we try to get, I don't know, to get it as close as possible. It's not the exact same thing, but it's still beautiful. It's gorgeous. It is gorgeous. And these are Georgian colours. You know what? This actually reminds me of Bridgerton. Mm. When, when you watch Bridgerton, it's very similar. So, as for presents, there's nothing we can show you at the minute. No, Kristen no. doesn't get any presents today. <laughs> You know what? That's totally fine. That's so fine by me as long as we spend time together. But remember, on Christmas I told you that I I really want an Apple Watch, which, yes, might be a gadget. Yeah, which we ordered, but it didn't arrive in time. No, it will, I don't know, it will arrive in 10 days. Yeah, as some of you know, Jörg and I do Nordic walking and when we travel or visit some National Trust properties, we do a lot of walking and it's nice to, I don't know, keep track of that and yeah, it's something I've really wanted for yeah. a while. And one of my sisters, she ordered something from Burley Pottery, which is amazing. And that hasn't arrived on time either. And I figure that it's because of lockdown as yeah. well. Like, remember last time I ordered something and it took so long, probably. I think they don't have enough people currently. Could be. Yeah. And my parents are so, so kind and they will contribute to having our our slipper chairs reupholstered. So that's wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Can't wait to have that. Me too. And other than that... We will try to have a Zoom call tonight. Yes. Yes. That With all the family. Yes. And you will probably make us some non-alcoholic cocktails. <laughs> hmm. Will you do it? Yeah, you get non-alcoholic and uh... I'll... You can, you can try you can try the alcohol uh, the non-alcoholic and then gradually yeah. start into having alcohol. Yes. But there's something, um, some, there's something else my sister and my parents and, and that's something sweet. You oh, can, yes. You can have a try. Oh. So let's, let's share. I the, cake, the cake was sweet enough. It was. It was amazing. But of course, heavy. But you know what? Today is the day of indulgence. Yeah. So, fine. So they send some chocolates. It's called Kevin Kugel, which is such a funny name. Yeah, because Kugel. Yeah. And Kugel in German means ball. Yes, ball. Kevin Ball, yeah. And lots of chocolate. And it looks amazing. Yeah. Wow. Truffles. Yeah. That looks so good. Yeah. And I thought I would share this company because you have to know about them. They are called the Punctilious Mr. P's Place Cart Company. This is where we got their place carts from. And if you're looking for something really special, I'm glad I stumbled upon them. This is the bakery I stumbled upon on the website Sherlock's. April's Baker in London and if you have a look here all the cakes they look so beautiful and yeah I got in touch with them but it wasn't possible to look to deliver here the courier would have been far more expensive than the cake itself but they said if we're ever in London or if we're in London the next time we should pop in they are so gorgeous, so in love. So if you live in London, 
check them out. I think it's so worth it. Thank you. Aww. So what else is happening? We will have some takeaway. Indian. And we have it, I think, three or four times a year. Yeah. And today is, is the best day for it. Yes. And it's our favourite Indian takeaway service, like takeaway restaurant. Yeah. It's wonderful. Yeah, the funny thing is, um, we discovered Indian food in the UK. Yeah, it's not the same in Germany. No. And we had it when my parents were here and they absolutely loved it as well. And yeah, it's I'm looking forward to it and we will share it with you. And it's always really really good yeah it's nice yeah although i must say i'm still i had i had two slices of cake which is probably too much <laughs> it was quite sweet and heavy but i don't know i have to show you i mean today's the best day to have cake and you actually confirmed it Jörg. yeah with your card yes so this is the card it's always a good day for cake and it's from Emma Bridgewater yeah. and we don't have cake every day. Sometimes I I bake cake maybe every three months so not not as often as you think but today is a good day. Yeah it is and you see there's so plenty of cake. Oh god yeah so much. It's getting messier by the minute in the kitchen, but I hope that's fine. So Jörg is going to make a non-alcoholic cocktail, which is called Fruity Mocktail, because I don't, I don't like alcohol. So this is what I chose and it sounds good and I, I think it's nice. Here it is, Fruity Mocktail from BBC Good Food. I think it sounds nice and we both love orange juice and it says it's very, very easy to make. I am doing. You're preparing the skewers and they have blueberries and grapes. Oranges. And it says, in the recipe it says, what does it say? Orange juice. Orange juice, but we decided to make, to make the orange juice fresh because that's so much nicer. It's a really old machine. Yeah, it is very old. We got it from... I know when we got it, when we had the house built. It was like a present from the bank or something. It was. Yes. I now remember. Yeah. You know why they gave us that? So they could squeeze the lay, you know, all our pennies out. <laughs> and now you need your, what's it called? Grenadine? Yes. Grenadine. So one teaspoon. Yeah, I'll take a little bit more for mine. Really? Yes. Don't you think that's too sweet? No. <laughs> so this is mine. This is yours. Yeah. You've got one, I've got two. Yeah, we'll see how it tastes. Then top it up with orange juice. Do you think we need more orange juice? No. You know what I think? We would have needed higher glasses for the skewers. That's fine. They aren't high enough. You have to serve it like that. Fruity mocktail for two. You can sit down. See, they are, they're just 
Half. Half of it. Oh. <laughs> but these ones are what light balls. Yes. Cheerio. Cheerio, Miss Sophie. Skull. Hmm. Mm. Something is missing. Oh, yeah. I think it was summertime. It's really good. That's nice. Oh, yes. Yeah. I think it would be a lot better with with uh, some ice and it just came to my mind that I want to show you this because this is a Christmas present from one of my sisters it came a bit later which is totally fine and like um, three little pots from Le Creuset and they are so beautiful can use them for souffle, for tiny dishes. And she said that they are perfect here in the kitchen and they really are. Love them. So what's next? What's next, Mr? Preparing for the Zoom call. Oh, preparing, that sounds like a meeting. Yeah. I don't think it is. <laughs> Not too much. Let okay. me see, let me see. Yeah, yeah. Because that's how it should have looked like. Yeah, I see what you mean. Yeah. What's happening? Want some gin? <laughs> Definitely not. What's your plan? Spicy dish. Seriously? Yes. I'll give it a try. Oh god. Uh, well, it sounds pretty disgusting. But um, maybe some whiskey on top as well? No. This is your non-alcoholic cocktail with alcohol. Now. Let's give that a try with some more grenadine. Was it a little bit better actually? Yeah. That yeah, it's a little bit better. Yeah, that's what I told you. You know what? I think there wasn't enough grenadine in it. Hey. Now let's try a red one. Mm, it smells good. Really? Yes. <laughs> this is almost as lively as our New Year's Eve party. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> you know what we could do? Well, we can't do it. Not here. Maybe in the attic. We should do some karaoke. Oh, yes. But we could never share that on uh, YouTube because we would... Lose all of our subscribers. I'm not so sure. Or maybe you would, you you would be a big discovery. Yeah, I would. Um, maybe not a big discovery. Maybe a big embarrassment. <laughs> Talking about singing, last weekend we watched Bohemian Rhapsody, yeah. and it was amazing. It really, it touched me. Yeah, it was a, re a really touching mood. It touched me so much that I wasn't able to sleep. And I was never a very big Queen fan. But I am, I am now. I, re I am now. And I think Freddie Mercury was such a special person. And although he died such a young age he is i i don't know he's not really dead is he no. he's just he's so extraordinary and i think so many musicians are still inspired and yeah if you haven't watched the film give it a go because yes. 
We really loved it. Yeah? What do you think? I don't know. If you don't like rock music, but it's not rock. It's, it's, no, it's, no. It's a special kind of rock it's music. It's so, yeah. It's yeah. so, so special. No, I, I like this kind of music, music because it has a try. <laughs> I don't like, I'm not, a, I'm not the guy who listens to ballads. Or to this kind of No, no, true. So I should be getting ready for the soon part. Danke übrigens für die ganzen Karten. Oh! Oh, ja, super! <laughs> und die Geschenke und die Pralinen und alles. Ja, <laughs> We just had a Zoom meeting with our family in Germany and it was amazing. This is the first time I've used it and it's lovely. I mean, I do talk to them via Skype or FaceTime, but having them all together is so nice. I think, yeah, Jörg, how long did we talk? Like one and a half hours. <laughs> and it was like, it was really funny. My sister had some sandwiches and she was like, here, do you want some? <laughs> it was really funny. It was nice. I mean, it's definitely nicer when you're like, when you're together in real life. But and in the meantime, we got our takeaway food. This is yours. No. You yeah. have a starter. What is it called? Veg samosa? Yeah. Let's have a look. I'll wait. We never had that before, so that's nice, I hope. Oh, ah, yeah. that looks nice. So, yeah, what did you order? Chicken. This is our main. Jörg has got Af Afghani chicken. It's called Af Afghani chicken. And I have a combination of chicken tikka, Masala and and chicken korma. Yep. Is it <laughs> chicken korma? And we've got some pila rice. And this is korma. My favorite. This is korma and yours. Oh, you smells nice. I know. It's the first time yeah. you have ordered this one. So that's chicken tikka masala, chicken korma, yeah. Afghani chicken, yeah. correct? And rice. Pilau rice. This looks amazing. Mm, it smells good. Yeah. This is, when it comes to Indian food, I'm quite boring because this is my favorite food, but I must say that Jörg's looks very, very good. So maybe I'll have that next time. Is it gluten-free? I don't know. I, don't I think it is. I think it is. So ignore the makeup, ignore the hair. <laughs> I don't care anymore. It's, I don't know, time flies. It's 9 p.m. now and I don't know. We had the Zoom call one and a half hours, Jörg. Yeah. So we had uh, we had dinner, which, by the way, was lovely. And now I talk to my mother-in-law, and we actually we plan on um, playing a game. 
but I'm not sure. But I have to show it to you once more because it's a game we played in the cottage. Yeah, in the pink cottage that we shared or that has so many views on our channel. And this game is hilarious. We can really recommend So when our godson Luca came to stay with us, we bought this game called What's That Smell? The party game that stings. <laughs> and it's it's amazing. It's funny, yeah. Now I see this warning. Delicate noses beware. Player discretion advised. <laughs> Can you open it for me? How many for how many people is it actually? Up to six. Oh, up to six people. So the sad thing is, it's a bit late to start it now because Jörg has to get up very early tomorrow morning to go to the office. So we will do it some other time, which is fine. Oh, you, you know what we could do? Maybe we can take it to a cottage and we can stay somewhere. But there's one thing I want to show you and you can see my reaction. So we haven't played that in two years, but I thought I would give this one a try on camera. Just this one, Whiff of Shame. And it says here, brush here to release stack. Jörg says he can already smell it, but I don't. So. You have to smell at the card. Ugh. But I'm not sure it really... It's a smell of an armpit. Yeah, I know. I can smell have it. Have a whiff. No, I can smell it here. <laughs> but there are other... Oh, this one. Extra old toe cheese. <laughs> No. <laughs> and this one is oh, <laughs> type up blowouts. <laughs> well, let's hide the armpit. <laughs> what what chunky vomit! It's disgusting, but um, a lot of fun. Yeah, I can, yeah, I can smell the armpit. You know, oh my God, smell this, smell this. It's on my finger. Mm. Oh, it's, on my, it's disgusting. Oh. <laughs> what have you got there? Pot. Mm. Pot wine. Yeah. So that was a nice afternoon. Yes. Some good cake. Yes. We yeah. have so much left. Yeah. A nice chat with her family. Yeah. Which is, should do that more often. Yeah. And uh, I showed them the place cards. Yeah. <laughs> and they found it quite hilarious. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I just thought it's nice to have something in mind for later, maybe. Yeah. Now we'll yeah, have to go to Germany later in this year. And to be honest with you, um, well, it's not very tidy anymore. It could be worse. Yes. We got a very nice delivery today as well. Um, a wonderful, it's like a, like a cupboard, yeah. like a cupboard, an antique cupboard for our bathroom. And hopefully we can redecorate our bathroom next year. We will have to wait and see. But um, at least we could secure a cupboard and I think you will like that as well. And yeah, we might share that next week. And we hope you like this video. It was basically, it was basically a kitchen video and like a normal, a, a birthday in lockdown. And I still enjoyed it, Jörg. It was still nice and... Maybe we can catch up 
with family later in the year, hopefully. We yes. will do. We'll have your party. Yes, we will have a little party. And, yeah, so stay tuned for the next video and see you again very soon. So, so <laughs> until next time and take care, guys. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Bye.